Welcome back. This is Demet God Christy or ito si Tito Juan. Depende kasi kung saan ko ilalag yung channel to. Kasi ang mga moto vlog ko ay pinupost sa parehong channel. At ang topic natin ngayon, a uh, um, few weeks ago may kasama na ako sa office na naaksidente in a uh, motorcycle. So, now, five reasons uh, motorcyclist ay uh, nagkakaroon na aksidente. What we do here is go back, 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 back. Bago tayo magsamula, we post content every week. So like and subscribe and don't forget to hit that notification button. So, malalaman mo kung may pinapload akong bagong video. One. Isa sa mga uh, cause ng accidents is what he called panic break. Ako, uh, uh, personally, sa amin ako sa mga accident dito. Uh, one thing about motorcycle, they have just two wheels. Dalang gulo na niya sa harapan at sa likod. Right? And uh, you may have both uh, a, a, front, a front brake and a back brake. Uh, brakes, regardless of front or back zone, must be applied gradual. Ang tawag nga is uh, a progressive braking. Now, a panic brake, when you have no situational awareness, bigla mong inanong yung ang brake mo, ang front brake mo, yung prenest mo. So, okay? So, usually, ang tamang progressive braking is to uh, brake from 10, 20, 30 to 100. Hindi ka pa nito ma, uh, maging from 100 bigla. should be progressive. Because once you apply a brake, the weight of the motorcycle will shift to the front. Mawawalan na ang traction ng front brake, ang uh, front wheel mo. Kasi bigla mag-stop mag siya. So, it causes a lot of uh, slips and slides. And it is common reasons for accidents, including mine. Okay, so it's very also important that you uh, check your wheel uh, commonly kapag bago yung uh, motorcycle mo for example in the Rouser and the Avenger uh, 220 in bike school wheels are stuck in the limo and the wheels for these uh, brands are usually not that good napakadulas you need to invest first buy and replace your wheels with a better brand like Dunlop also depending upon you the how much you uh use your your motorcycle if you're a provincial rider you may uh, need to replace it much more often bago mo nga tayo lumabas na yung mga alambre bago mo baltaan makalbo na ang gulong bago mo baltaan as uh, i said in my last um, the vlog uh, last uh, video isang accident ko with in Angona last year is nadulas yung motorcycle ko in the epoxy pedestrian lane and i was not running that uh, uh, fast and to make it a habit to apply your back brake, your, your rear brake first before the front brake. It's very important that um, when you're riding, there's enough distance uh, between you and the next vehicle. Uh, may braking distance na tawag yan. Di, in, we're not like a car na kaya natin apply yung brakes natin and then titigil agad yan. The uh, more fast you run, the longer the braking distance. So that's why you have to maintain a reasonable speed uh, below the speed limit of uh, that area. Uh, I'll, I'll post here uh, in the Philippines uh, the recommended speed uh, for the type of roads in the Philippines. Two. Another reason for uh, common crashes uh, in, is the waiting to turn. Now, usually in a road, May mga intersection siya. May intersection, may, may lane going from the right or the left. Now, the problem is when a vehicle is waiting to turn, either to join your, your, your lane or to transfer to another lane, means na kakamali, magtansya ng speed. Minsan, kapanit pa ito. That is why it's highly recommendable to have one or two uh, spaces or caution space between you and the next vehicle. Especially pag motorcycle ka, uh, maraming nagagaw ng, na, ano, ng lane mo. Other motorcyclists, other cars, nagagaw ng lane mo. So, 
minsan nag uh, nabibigla ka um, at the same time minsan na may miss uh, na malintan siya mo na akala mo masyado ako mabilis pero after you can mm-hmm. actually do it okay. it's very important mm-hmm. you have situation awareness as I've seen my last video the Look sure that to your right, okay, should look left mirror, side mirrors, put your back, left and right, uh, look at your, uh, the, the look near, not look far, and uh, also, situational awareness. When you're sick driving, you're driving in the city, off to work, uh, there's a lot of things going on, a lot of things are a lot of movie parts. Now, because of that, maraming pa din mayari. So, you need to be alert. So, that means, intoxication is out, dapat hindi kayo na antok. Pag lasing ka, antok ka, mag-commit ka na lang pa, or matulog ka na lang. Yun lang naman yun eh. Diba? Uh, you have actually two accessories in your motorcycle that you can use. Your lights, and your horn. Diba? So, you can either uh, turn off or on your lights. Diba? If it's, especially if night, makikita agad yun. Or you could uh, honk your horn. For safety, you honk your horn more. Kahit na ano, kahit na. <laughs> kahit na maingayin sila. It's safety. You have to make them aware that you're coming. Mga ano, mga tricycle. Nako, ang dami nun. Liko muna bago tingin. Yan ang galing nila. So, kusina ka. Pa, pa. Diba? Three. The next thing is path of travel. Ano yung sabihin nun? Things in their path of travel, ang sarapan mo, will cause you to crash. We're talking about debris. Nako! Uh, again, babalik ako yung kwento ko na yung aso. Yung tumawid. Basura. Nangyari yung sortigas na aksidente ako. Mga basurero, mga itakas ng basura. Siguro may nahulog galing sa likod ng basura nila. E ano ito? Uh, basa. Yung parang uh, prutas na na nangisikoshi. Parang ganoon. So, Madulas! Hindi mo na, di, di ako nagano ah, hindi ako nag-brake ah. Nadulas na yung wheel ko, dahil sobrang dulas. So, anything in front of you will cause you to crash. Again, I'm emphasizing that you should be running a speed that is below the recommended speed limit for that uh, area, for that type of road, provincial, uh, residential, or, uh, or uh, city road. And be honest to yourself, up to what speed ang kaya may control, diba? Diba? Remember, the more faster you run, the more higher the risk of an accident. Why? Because the, the, the lower is your control. Ganun na yun. Diba? So, uh, if you're not comfortable running in high speeds, do not do it inside the city. Ganun na yun, diba? Uh, kung ikaw magasak sa mga kamote driver, may nang patakbo, lalo sa Marcus Highway, na nag-drag racing, diba? Patsya ka pa yung utak nyo, tanga kayo, diba? Kasi nga, unang-una, that's not the right um, venue for that. Kung binig ka sa sarili mo, na kaya mong mag-control ng motor mo, uh, wag mo ka may damay. Ano yun, 120, uh, 120, 150? Ang motor ko is 220, kaya-kaya ang unahan, unahan ng motor ko ang motor nyo. Pero, ako hindi ko kaya. I'm not trained to be, uh, you know, uh, ganun ka reflexive. So, yan ang tatandaan mo. Maaaring feeling mong galingan mo. Kaya mong uh, uh, money over ang motor mo at high speeds. Pero, not all the people around you can do that. Diba? Be- that's why you should not run your, your motorcycle above the speed limit. Think about yung pedestrian. Think about other uh, drivers, cars, jeeps, and um, motorcycles. Not all of them are trained as you are. Hindi magaling na kayo. Four. The next one is, again, speed. Speed through a corner. Uh, tandaan mo, when you're turning a corner, ang pinakus sa mga motor, mga, sure, mga backbone, mga banking. There's nothing wrong with bounce. But it's actually, uh, you need to learn how to bounce. Use your body weight to balance when you throw. Pero, tanda mo where you are. You're not in a highway. You're not in a racetrack. That means, 
when you're in a when you're in the city and you're making a turn in a corner, you slow down. Especially in uh, dead corners, you do only thing that I think. Uh, one thing about uh, turning a corner, you must be on the outer corner. Para may 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 visibility uh, sa ano sa gilid ko mo. You will never know. Kung may tatawid, may maganda o eh, may pedestrian, di ba? May tatawid. May ganon. There's uh, there's a different in driving behavior in city, in provincial, in racetrack. Okay. And it's all about numbers, the number of moving parts. Kapag nasa city ka, of course, marabi moving parts. We're talking about pedestrian, hayo, uh, other cars, other motorcycles, diba? So, iba yung driving behavior mo doon. In provincial, ganun din. Although, lesser ang mga moving parts, there's still the trucks, there's still the poche, under pa rin pedestrian. Uh, ada pun mahayo. <laughs> One time we went to uh, uh, Tanai, ni aso, aso kan nama. Kalau tu apa ngah? Kalau tak ada. So ini macam apa guys? So ibarat yang behavior mo, provincial. Kapag nasa track ka, ibarat yang behavior mo. Why? Uh, number one, the, the track race is very ideal. So the road is very clean, no debris. Same time, everybody's moving in one direction, and the skill level of all people in the race track is much or le, uh, more or less magkata yung skill level nila. So, you can, pwede kang magmadali, pwede kang mag uh, top speeds mo. But when you're in city, when you're in provincial riding, you don't do that. Uh, we, you turn the we corner, don't do that. you turn the outermost corner, and you slow down. That's uh, using progressive uh, braking, that's using a rear brake or engine brake either of the three as long as you slow down it's safety first safety first safety for you that you that is turning and safety for sino man tao ang nagtatawid kung sino man coach ang may o or sa akin na tanga tata ka tanga may mga ganun napakadami yun diba hindi mo lang pa nagalisensya again situation awareness number two speed is a factor number three you should slow down in every corner and you should be on the outer lane of the corner. Five. And the last one is of course, focus. Uh, Nasaib ko na sa dating uh, video ko yun. Urit murit. Focus. One thing is that uh, kapag nag-drive ka every day, day in the out, you're a city driver like me, me. Diba? You use your bike. When you go to the market, you go use your bike. When you go to your friends, you go use your bike. When you go to work, and then come back. But sometimes, when you're a new rider, you, you're still trying to practice your focus. I get it. Totoo yon, di ba? Nagaral ka pa yun. You're trying to uh, expand your uh, your senses, you know, situational awareness, na your horizon, niyari, near and far. Kapag pero kapag ano ka na, pero kapag uh, seasoned rider ka na. Yung yung problema, uh, masyado ka nang nag, medyo naging relax ka na. So you're not really paying attention. Right? So big, may bigla ka na may tatawin. Ang bibigla ka na may mag-cut sa'yo. Diba? So, so that causes you to panic break. That causes you to uh, to, to mis misjudge your speed. So those things causes um, uh, accidents. And now that means alcohol is out. Diba? Never ever when you have a buzz, <laughs> diba, you, you drink. Sama kaya ko to, kaya ko to. Uh, my friend that I was to, telling you about, my office mate, na accident siya. That una una, he, he was a new rider. Although he have ridden occasionally, he just bought his motorcycle like a month. It's just a just turned month old yung motorcycle niya. Right? So, malakas pa yung loob niya. At least, uh, sinabi sa akin yung mga tao. Now he's doing things that he shouldn't be doing with the bike, no hands, and all. And he came from drinking with his drinking bunnies. Madaling araw to. So, nagmamadali siya. So, ano, ang factors niya was number one, he was drunk. Number two, sa Commonwealth to, so, ang bista ko niya. So, speed, he was not following the, the recommended speed of the, the area. Number three, waiting to turn. Ando lahat, actually. Yung jeep na... Pare ko, sabi daw, kumana nung, nung after lumiko. So, he was not situationally aware, and of course, he was intoxicated. 
So, ganun bagay. So, all the factors, unsafe action, unsafe conditions, nagsama-sama. Kaya na-accident uh, siya. So, ang ending niya, uh, na bali ang kanyang, kanyang leg. Oh, so, ngayon, it will take around a year for him to be able to uh, stand up again. Again, I recommend the videos the channel of uh, Dan Dan the Fireman. Very English siya. At the same time, it's in the States. So, iba yung uh, condition ng uh, Florida States, di ba? So, yun yung isipin mo. Pangalawa, iba-iba yung mga behaviors ng mga American states. Sila, they respect the the distance between vehicles. Sa atin, wala eh. Ganun talaga yung mga tao dito eh. If you like this video, diba, support the channel uh, by clicking the like and subscribe. Also, hit the notification button. So, when I upload, uh, you'll be notified of any new uploads. If you have any requests, maybe motor vlog, maybe gaming, maybe... Uh, Anything, uh, 80s uh, experience, let me know right in the comment below. Magandang buhay sa inyong lahat. Bye-bye.